Oh Lord, won't you buy me a drone for my YouTube TV? This is a 1982 B21 F. Look at the crosshatch still in the bore. I am so glad you are here because today we're in our PJs. We're celebrating being in our PJs. Today we are not fixing a refrigerator. We are fixing a head gasket on a B21 F and making a Frankenstein motor. This is a B21, and it had mechanical yes. fuel injection on it. Over there, that's KJ. And this is what I'm gonna put on it. This is MicroSquirt, which is electronic fuel injection. 16T turbo, we're definitely gonna use a lot of that wire right there. Here's the trick, use an extension to screw the bolts down snug, but never, ever, ever use your impact. That impact will get you in trouble. It'll squish the gaskets out on both ends and split it right down the middle and rip it so you'll have a great little channel to leak at every bolt hole if you over tighten these bolts. So when I say snug, I mean snug. Not super tight, not super loose, but just barely snug. So we'll go all the way around and then we'll go all the way around again. Just snug. Because each time we tighten one of these bolts up, the next one gets loose. Of course, we cleaned the inside of this motor again, like I said I was going to do. We'll put this pan back on. A little Ultra Gray on it. Morelli Auto Parts. Help this gasket stick to the oil pan again. Now you'll notice something different with this red block today. You see, we have no wire harness running through all this nonsense. In and out of the block on this side, in and out of the block on the back side. No. It's a good look, this Bluetooth look, wireless. Bah. I'm gonna line these cylinders with a little bit of oil. We don't want the board to rest up. We don't want the rings to lock up. We don't want anything to get crusty. But basically what I was doing was folding up rags and the quarters, sticking some regular alcohol on them, absorbing, and then wiping, wiping, wiping. Tedious cleaning effort. I want to add a sticky to the surface because I know that it's a little rough and we didn't have the money to take it to the machine shop and machine it. I'm gonna do a little preventative maintenance and apply some stuff. Interesting times we live in, no doubt. What I mean is, uh, I used to get this stuff and put on the head gasket surfaces for uneven surfaces. And I've tried this stuff too, but this stuff is like my preference. But I called my favorite parts store got it. It's on back order in spray and paint form. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the Shellac. I've used this on Supers before with good luck. We're going to use this stuff. It's a Versichem Lion Gasket Shellac. We're going to coat this on the surface areas, both the head and the block, and we're going to squish it together. This is the water pump gas that came with it. This is the one I pulled off of it. I only want to concentrate the sealant where I need it at. And I need it around the coolant passages, the oil passages, the pistons. So we're going to dab it. Here we have a B21F gasket 
and a B230 gasket. The first thing you'll notice is the bore is significantly different. The second thing you'll notice is this ridge right here. It's kind of strange. This jacket isn't open like the other ones are. A little bit different. Everything else lines up about the same. Head bolt holes. Everything else is about the same. Really interesting that this is blocked off. See you next week, so keep your...